So let's start by comparing transcendent light. Transcendent light is this deep shade. This is from the new palette. This is from the old palette. And as you can see, they are exactly the same shade. And this is the old palette and the new palette. I don't see many similarities, but I'm definitely swatching this one, the pink one as well to compare. And glow, straw white, radiant bronzer, and the radiant powder as well. So the new palette, the bronzer, and the radiant bronze shade. So I do feel that the radiant is closer but not in tone. In terms of tone actually the bronzer is closer but this one, the new highlighter shade, have a little bit of more pinkish tone in person. The camera looks very beige but in person is aha. I think like this you can see a little bit of more true color. It have a little bit of a pinky tone to it. And this is burnished glow. Definitely a unique shade. Now, in reticent rose, it's a nice pinky shade, and I'm gonna compare with a pink shade from last year. This one, I think, that will be the most comparable shade. I'm gonna put one on the side. It's definitely warmer. Let me check this curly shade. is a little bit closer. I would say the curl shade is a little bit closer but the tone is still slightly different. This one does have that rose tint to it. Let's swatch this highlighter, Copper Flush. It's a beautiful soft copper shade. This one has like a rose gold tone to it, while this one is going to be more champagne. The, the lights really wash out a lot. Okay, if I do shadow like this, I feel like you can see more the true tone. But these are uh, all the colors, swatched and comparisons. 